While all this was going on at the house, what was unfolding at the store? Well, this gentleman walked up to me out on the floor and asked if I was Mr. McCurry, and I said yes, and he said, you need to, I'd like to talk to you in private if I could, and I hesitated for a moment, and finally he showed me a piece of paper with my name and address and phone number on it, and said I need to go call home. So I, I walked to the back with him then, and uh, immediately started to dial home, and uh, he kept trying to shut the door to the office, and I told him to leave the door open. And uh, finally picked up the phone after I saw that he wasn't going to leave the door open and paged uh, a security officer that works there. And uh, when he heard me page him, he asked who he was, and I said, well, he's one of the guys who works here. And uh, he came when he, right after I paged him, he pulled a gun. And, uh, stood behind the door so that when the man came through the door, he stuck the gun in his face and told him to sit down and uh, left him and another employee back in the office that had also seen him and he made her come into the office too. And uh, he told me, uh, he told me I better, I better call home if I thought anything of my family and children. So I called home and uh, during the time the first man left to go to the store to pick up the money, while you were waiting for him to return, what did uh, what did all of you do? Well, we sat in the living room and uh, just really read the Bible and and, uh, and we just uh, felt a very very joyful peace come over us after we had read the Bible. And what was the gunman doing during this time? Well, he was just sort of searching the house, looking in the closet, uh, looking around, looking around to see if I was going to be sick. Did you talk to him at all? Oh, yes. We, uh, I asked him if he would come in and uh, share the Bible with him. We'd like to share things with him this morning. Well, did he receive a signal? Did he receive a signal from the house? No. No signal. Uh, I just thought they probably had it planned out moment by moment what they were going to do. Did he leave on foot? Did he leave on yes, foot? he did. He, uh, yes, he did. He uh, just opened the door and just walked opened the door out. And he told us not to leave the living room or open the door, the door, the door, the door, door, the door and, and stay put. And, and that's what we did. And, and he did. Uh, and he did. 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 Did you try to get out, of the, house to get out of the house at all? Uh, at one uh, point, I did. I became concerned about my husband. I thought maybe they might have kidnapped him from the store. And so, so I slipped out, out the back door, the back door trying to get to, to get my neighbor's to my house, house and, and yes, to, yeah, to, yeah, to, to your home. To your home. And, and I could not, I could uh, not uh, if the door was open, they were smelled from the rain, and I couldn't even budge them. I tried to go up the doors, and I even tried to jump over the fence, and I, I couldn't. So I just came on 